make partial measures in Finale. For repeats, step one, open your document. If you need a pickup and you forget to specify a pickup measure in the document wizard, you can go to Documents, Pickup Measure, and create it there. Step two, choose a time signature tool and double click the measure with the pickup. A dialog box will appear. Step three, choose a time signature that splits the measure where you need it. For mine, I need 158 and 118 measure. Make sure you choose only the measure you're working on as the region. Repeat the process for the second measure. Step four, choose the measure tool and double click the measure with the new time signature. A dialog box will appear. Step five, under time signature, choose always hide in the drop down menu. Click OK. Step six, add your repeat bar line as usual in the measure break. If you just need to split a measure across a line, an option is to use the same technique as above. Instead of the repeat bar line, simply right click the measure on the top line while in the selection or measure tool and go to bar line invisible. For the official finale way to split a measure. Step one, choose the measure tool. Step two, double click the measure you want to split. Step three, check horizontal split points to click OK. Step four, double click the new third handle that appears on the right side of the measure. Move the slider where you want to split the measure. Step five, highlight the measure with either the selection or measure tool and press the down arrow. You're done.